Okay, so first up, we're gonna open it. So I bought these like I ordered them about a week and a half ago, and they only just arrived. Even though it's express post, um, I guess because of COVID or whatever, that's that's why. Get rid of that, so you don't see my address. Oh, thank you. Yes. So, I don't know if this bag is made out of the same material, like linen. So this is a um, double special set, which includes fitted sheet, a quilt cover, and pillowcases. So there's no flat sheet. And it's all like wrapped up in cardboard. Feels pretty nice. You can see like all the inconsistencies with the like the threading. That's like normal linen because um, I don't know. I think they have the the fiber is just longer, and they have to weave it together more or something, which makes it more inconsistent. It actually feels really nice. It feels like, um, feels like a cotton that's just uh, a bit thicker and has a bit more texture to it. So compared to this one, this one's a lot thinner and smoother. This one's like thick and soft. So this is the, that's the, that's the quilt cover there. And that's the, that's the pattern on there. There is a pattern on there, it's not just grey. It's a pinstripe pattern. Pillowcases. <laughs> Very wrinkly. Or as I would say, rustic. Hmm. So it's actually it's actually more see through than the cotton. I think that the thread counts like lower, but they count it based on um, the weight of the material per per meter. So here's fitted sheet, and then I'm gonna get into macro photography. Is that leather? Why are they going to put leather on my sheets? I don't want leather. So I'm going to get the macro tube on the camera and show you close up comparison. Okay, so I'm just trying to get a close up. So this is a fabric from very close. And this is the cotton. So the cotton <laughs> obviously has a way higher thread count than the linen, but um, I don't think that matters. So this is the cotton, same distance to linen. So the, the fibers are much thicker in the linen. And this is the bag, which I assume is also linen. And if we bring it up to the light, you can see all the different <laughs> sizes of the threads. That's pretty cool. And then if we bring the, the cotton up to the light. So that's a comparison. <laughs> All right, so now <laughs> look at it. It's like almost see-through when you look through it in macro. So now I'm just gonna go put it on my bed. I've just put the sheets on, so fitted sheet, uh, court cover, and the two pillowcases. Um, so I've had a look around like most of the stitching and I haven't found anything wrong with it. Not that I know much about it. 
just like a few stray fibers like like that and you can see like all the uh, different textural irregu irregularity like uh, this I can't focus well like that black thing there it's just like all over but that's what linen's known for so it's pretty cool so I'm just gonna jump in here and you can watch me jump in bed oh and this is in my van by the way so yeah I got a bed in my van so I slept in the bed twice now with the new sheets on it and it feels fine the, the sheets are nice and soft and clean and you know all that stuff but it's not as soft as just the nice cheap cotton sheet set so um, apparently that's the thing with linen is uh, once you've had it for a while like I don't know years or something then apparently it gets softer the more like the more you wash it and the longer you own it and it also lasts a lot longer but so far um, I think just a nice set of cotton sheets would <laughs> would feel nicer to be honest and it would be a lot cheaper but if you got the extra money to you know burn on this stuff and it's it's burning a hole in your pocket and you just want to get some sheets that are going to last a long time because these sheets are probably going to last for 20 years and give them to your kids or whatever then go for it uh, they're good quality they're not as soft as uh, a nice you know even 300 th thread count cotton sheet out of the box but it still feels fine for me and if you're more sensitive to that then you might have some problem but um, I like it buy it if you want all right that's my that's my useful review bye bye thank you